it's Natalia Fricker here, uh, back uh, live streaming from Survivor's Runway, our fashion show with a difference. If you watched the show, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it was a fantastic uh, experience for everyone here, and I hope for you online as well. Um, I have the absolute privilege of being joined here by the beautiful Nuran Nahar. Um, she is not only a survivor of acid attacks, uh, but she's also dedicated her life to uh, speaking out against violence against women and girls. And she now works for ActionAid in Bangladesh um, and is involved in the ActionAid, uh, um, the uh, Acid Attack Survivor Network, which ActionAid Bangladesh helped set up. Um, Nura Nahar, we'd love to hear your um, thoughts and how you're feeling after the show. Um, can you tell us a bit about what it was like for you as an experience? Uh, really, I, it was very fantastic. Uh, I feel honored to perform here. And uh, uh, really, people are so nice. They are always uh, encouraged us to clapping their hand. And uh, really, I feel good and um, uh, uh, I enjoy it. I enjoy my performance. I'm so glad to hear it. Um, and this is the first time you've actually left Bangladesh, is that right? Or not? No. no. Have you been to the UK before? Yeah. No. no, no. no. Okay. What, what's, it like being, uh, what's it like being in the UK for the first time? Uh, yes, uh, I feel good because uh, uh, here people are so lovely and uh, the city are so clean and weather is good. Um, all the things I like, the, all the things in, in the city uh, and uh, especially people are so friendly. I like it. I'm so glad people have been friendly. That's lovely to hear. Um, so, uh, Nuran Nahar, you were actually attacked back in 1995, which is quite a long time ago. Um, and you've been involved with the uh, Acid Attack Survivor Network for quite some time in Bangladesh. Could you tell us uh, a bit about your involvement and how that's helped you uh, recover and uh, the solidarity from meeting other survivors? And also tell us a bit about your involvement with ActionAid Bangladesh. Um, uh, from 2004, I involving with Action Bangladesh. Uh, I am uh, of the focal person for the Survivors Network. Um, I like to work for them, and uh, you know that uh, we try to uh, reintegrate the SS survivors and. Uh, 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 we motivated them to back their study and uh, counseling them to do something uh, because uh, after the uh, uh, attack, uh, people are getting traumatized. So we try to work for that, overcome that trauma. And uh, uh, we uh, have the network called Shetu Bandhan Gori Network. It's uh, SC for SC survivors. And uh, we try to uh, connect uh, within survivor. Uh, it is the platform uh, all survivor can share their pain and uh, their thinking. And uh, I always say to them, uh, this is not finished. This, your life is not finished. You have future. If you think you like to do something, you have. You have. Uh, so don't stop your life. Try to do something. And we are mobilized people to stop violence against women, stop acid violence. And we uh, have campaign uh, campaign uh, that uh, uh, work for uh, open market stop to open market as sell in Bangladesh, and now there people are very much aware about this issue. So, uh, thank you so much for sharing that with us. Um, and can you tell us just a little bit more about how it helped you personally? How being part of the network helped you? Um. Uh, you know that uh, uh, when I working with Action in Bangladesh, and this is my idea to build a network. Um, it was your idea. Yeah. Wow. So I feel that um, 
people when someone attacked by acid people are ignore her and family uh, always not uh, in her side uh, and sometimes she or he feel alone so uh, i think uh, i have pain i uh, feeling pain but the people are same uh, pain so how can i do something for them that's why i thinking about the network and i think it's a good bl uh, platform that we can share our, our pain and understand if some survivor uh, 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 share her pain with me it's very easy but uh, it's not very easy to uh, share with uh, normal people not uh, not survivor yeah Oh, I'm, I'm so glad. It's such an amazing uh, group that you've set up and the, the, tonight is a, is a witness to that. Uh, all the eight uh, acid attack survivors who are here with us this evening who've uh, been uh, walking the runway, uh, they all know each other because of the incredible network that Nura Nahar initiated um, and started with the support of ActionAid Bangladesh. So she is really the, uh, the, uh, the, the starting point um, for uh, what has led to this show. Um, so thank you so much, Nura and Nahar. We really hope you enjoy the rest of uh, your stay here with us, um, with ActionAid UK, um, and uh, that you uh, enjoy going back and, and telling everyone else uh, back home, and good luck with all the amazing work you continue to do to, um, to, to fight for justice for, for survivors. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, that's, uh, that's all from uh, this live stream. Thank you very much for watching. We hope you've been inspired by uh, Nuran Nahar and her uh, incredible resilience. Um, uh, and uh, we wish you uh, a very good night.